I've just moved the Y and Z coordinates to zero and I'm going to rotate around the A axis and you'll notice that the uh, rotation cone should go around the point Okay, I'm going to move the z-axis up. And I'm going to rotate the a-axis again and it should still rotate. Okay, then I'm going to take, move the Y axis to minus one. Actually, it's now going to be one. And you're going to notice that the orientation of the tool will be different as it goes around in a circle in addition to be going a larger radius because the hypotenuse is larger so here we go Let's go move the, um, the, ax the y axis in the other direction. And okay, let's move the a axis again here. Let's move the Y axis to see what happens. This is the Y axis, not the Z axis. Okay, I think that's an adequate demo of what's happening.